What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another trailer reaction here on the channel. This time we got pretty much um, the aftermath of the final day of Star Wars Celebration on the Monday, which is kind of funny. Um, that's pretty much Volume 2, Season 2 of Visions. Um, been looking forward to this uh, since the, the first season, first volume came out uh, back a little while ago. Um, I did like it. I remember... I remember when it did come out, I wasn't uh, reacting to anything on YouTube at the time, but I remember really enjoying it. I remember there was some, it, it was hit or miss. Like there was some like slower episodes, which I didn't really like, but there was some like really good episodes and there were some really good takes uh, on Star Wars and stuff. And I was excited that they ended up getting a second iteration and a bunch of new artists came together. Um, I'm excited to see some sneak peeks of this, only two minutes, but um, I'm excited to see, you know, like what it gets. Definitely going to react to these all on the channel and stuff. So i uh, pretty excited about that. Um, and uh, yeah, I believe nine. They said nine shorts, I thought I heard. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see what, what, what take they take on Star Wars this time around. Um, it should be pretty fun. And uh, I just want to see what the hell they, ha they have and everything. And guys, if you got to see this uh, live at Star Wars Celebration, let me know. I heard there was a Bad Batch teaser uh, and announced as the last season of the Bad Batch, which is kind of bittersweet and stuff. But if you guys actually seen that, let me know down in the comments. But yeah, with that, might as well get it started. Ooh, I already like it. Nice and dark. Woo! That's it. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Lightsabers look so cool in the animation style. Everyone Ooh. has an inner light. Follow the light. I love the different types, man. It's so oh, cool. You animation. For bigger things. What if you just keep going? There are others hmm. like you here. I saw it myself. She has special powers. Oh, Can you that's get different. Porter potty off the star. <laughs> Another way different. Oh. Exactly. <laughs> May the force be with you. I love like the Pokemon esque, like um, you know, like Naruto. Like I love that that type of animation style. A storm is approaching. Oh, I like that. That looks cool. Okay. We can beat them. Oh. Now different animation looks funny. <laughs> that reminds me of Yoshi's like uh, crafted world. You guys ever played that on Switch? With the yarn. Ooh, the soundtrack got me going. <laughs> Takes us. This is hype. Dual saber. Oh. Yo. That was hype. Way more hype than I thought, honestly. Oh, that's it. Jeez. Wow, that was really good. I really liked that. It was quick. It flew by. Um, just so many different, like, yeah, that's what I love about it. It is so diverse. And I think it was such such a cool concept. I think, like, whoever thought about this, very, very smart and very creative uh, to think of this. And, and like, it just sees different takes. Like, almost it was reminding me of, like, if you guys ever played those, like, Yarn Yoshi games on, like, Wii U Switch. Kind of reminded me of that. That one animation style. Then you got, like, the different types. One looked very real. Looked like something now. Then you kind of reminded me of that, like, Pokemon, you know, Dragon Ball Z. Uh, Naruto kind of reminds me of that sort of stuff. Different, like, that's more, like, that route. It's it just very diverse. I love it. I know all the different animation studios. Definitely going to look into a little more when I do watch it. Uh, which studios, which, and, and where, where they're located, what, what nationalities uh, they are and stuff. Cause it's always cool to... Go check that out like like the first season was so diverse and stuff and yeah i loved it like the like the dual sabers even the double the double sabers um it, it, it was really cool they really like you could tell they did different things right you seen a tie fighter coming at that like little kid and stuff and just kind of just like trying to use the force i guess or something it was it was cool i liked it like and like like i said the, the animation styles it's not just like like it's not just like little right like it, they're completely different like on most of them so um and that's why it would definitely will be a treat and stuff and uh hopefully better than the first season because i think it could definitely be better because some of them were extremely slow the first time around so you know if they can completely like take out those ones like if they could if they could replace like the slow ones in a complete season and like one full like 
banger season like be amazing i would love it and this is something they can continue to do like they don't have to stop here like i know they're originally saying it was just supposed to be a one-time thing but they can continue doing this honestly as long as studios want to want to make it it doesn't take too much time from from you know disney and stuff because at the end of the day like the studios are creating them and they're just shorts it's not like it's a full-on like episode or like, like a bad batch episode or something like that so definitely pretty realistic but um yeah pretty much yeah it was just a, it was more like a teaser of what's to come the soundtrack was fantastic i loved it got me hyped up giving those goosebumps that was good and uh and yeah though in terms of a trailer rating i'm gonna give that so eight out of ten that was very good uh not too much for me but you know something i'm even more excited for may 4th and uh you know and uh, it's gonna be fun and even though i'm a little pissed off today about star wars not gonna lie like obviously fine you know Bad Batch final season that I couldn't go to celebration this year. Finding out, I was like, oh, okay, I can't wait for next year, right? They're skipping next year. And not only that, in, they're going they're going to be back in 2025 in April again and in Tokyo. And like, I, I'm not going to lie, like everybody out there in Japan, like I'm happy for you. But geez, like I was hoping to go next year or like 2025. I mean, honestly, like I would love to make the trip down to Tokyo. I've never been to Japan, so that'd be really cool. But um Oh, I'm bummed out because of that. I really am. I, I, I wish, I wish. Uh, I don't want to make it a celebration rant video, but just uh, very disappointed about that. Can't believe we're not going to have a celebration for a year, especially after uh, COVID uh, 2020 and 2021 completely knocked them out. Just a shame. And uh, and I live up here in Toronto, so like I, I, like I, I usually hope for a US one and I'll head down, right? But yeah. I think the next the next chance really for for that to be in in, in North America is going to be I'm going to be 26 when that comes. So I don't even want to think about that. Don't want to think about that at all. So yeah. But anyways, that pretty much wraps up though for my reaction though to Visions the uh, Volume Two trailer. What do you think, guys, down below and stuff? Uh, what do you think? Obviously, were you something you were looking forward to from Star Wars? Are you excited to see what the studios bring? And uh, you know, uh, what was your thoughts on the first season like? Like what I said, did you think they're all good? Do you not really like them as much? You know what I mean? Just give me your thoughts down below. And don't forget, if you enjoy the reaction, leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn that notification bell down below as well. You will be notified for uh, when I react to the entire series, probably with one of my buddies. Uh, we'll definitely either break it up or we'll do it all in one, depending on the lengths and stuff. Um, I believe they said nine, so we might have to split it up, maybe like one to five and like six to nine or something like that. Then we could do a separate review or something like that. Cause Tales of Jedi, we just ripped it in one video. We were like, screw it, right? So um, yeah, but anyway, stay tuned if you're interested in that. Also for wrapping up Mando right now, these last two weeks. Um, and pretty much that's it. Like lots of other stuff on the channel too. It's just, uh, yeah. Uh, and uh, hopefully y'all who went to celebration had a great time uh, out there in London and stuff. Uh, you guys, uh, it, look, it looked like a blast and stuff. It looked very fun. Uh, definitely very jealous, not gonna lie, but I'm looking forward to hopefully, uh, you know, some good content to get us through the next couple years before before the next one. I uh, can't believe I'm saying that next couple years. Jeez, that really has me bummed. But anyways, do not ramble on for too much longer. Star Wars Visions Volume 2 looks great. Love the diversity. And I'm excited for May 4th. And uh, it's always a special day for us. So definitely looking forward to that date. So, but anyways, guys, appreciate y'all for tuning in. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Nice.